that one just had a, a, an abundance of characters um, who, who, who were just fantastically able to spin a story. Yeah. And uh, Garland Lindsay was one. Yeah. Uh, Garland, was Garland could stand and look you dead in the eye and tell you a lie, and you'd absolutely <laughs> believe it. He, the story was that the whistle blew at the uh, yep. chair factory. Yeah, the whistle. Yeah. And work was over, so he was coming up through town. Now the the taxi cab uh, used to be right across from Richardson's drugstore on the corner, and uh, and the office consisted of a pole with a protection box and a phone inside of that. That was the office yeah. where the cab yeah. me. And that's where a lot of people hung out uh, on that corner. Because the taxi driver was there waiting on the phone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and and then there was access to the drugstore. They had restroom in the drugstore. Then there was, but the people hung out on that corner. That's where they socialized. One day, the story goes that Garland came running up the street by the taxi stand and one of the guys said, hey Garland, hey Garland, stop, stop a minute. He said, come here and tell us a lie. <laughs> and Garland supposedly said, oh, I'd like to, but I don't have time. He said, I've got to get down to the ferry. He said, it just sunk. He said, there's six or eight cars in there. Garland went on home, and all those people on the corner went down to the ferry and said, it sunk. <laughs> 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 